Okay, no, no. Here, here, where is the oles? Oles, they are at a depth h by 2. So what is the velocity of flx? Straight away. So this will be v. This will be v. So what is v is equal to root of 2g h by 2. Root of gh. Then this emerging liquid will exert a force on this one. Thrust force it is called as. <laughs> So what is the area of cross section of the small holes? Area A, A this is. And we know thrust force is what? Rho V, Rho A V square. V is how much root GH? So this much of force acting. So anything will happen to container? The container will ex experience a torque. This you, you will better go for top view. If you view from the top, it will appear like this. This is R. This is R. So there's a top view. This is an emerging liquid. So this is the top view. I think not vertically up, vertically down. Please, uh, you, you must have enough of common sense here. You, you are weaving from top. Then, then the top view diagram will be like this. Then this emerging liquid will exert a force. This emerging liquid will exert a force. So will this force will set up torque about O? Yes. So what is the torque? Should be equal to 2F into R plus R. What is the axial distance? R plus R, 2R. So this will set up a torque. No? This is 2R, this is F. Torque will be like this. Huh? This is R plus R, 2R. 2R and F, this torque is. So the net torque, how it will be? About O, it will be in this direction. Hmm. What is F? Rho A G H. This will be 2R. So 4. A, G, H, Rho, R. So like this, the emerging liquid will also exert a torque. Simple, simple things. So it will, so what will happen to it? It will start spinning this one. 